This stretch of Alvarado Boulevard, just west of downtown near 7th Street, is known for stores, restaurants, and the underground sales of illegal documents. In this TVK News undercover investigation, I posed as a student from Korea looking to buy a fake social security card. I strike up a conversation with this random young man. I tell him that I want to buy a social security card. He says he can't help me, but directs me across the street to someone who can. I speak to another man in front of this 99 cent store. He guides me to the back of the store. 40 minutes and $100 later, I have a new identity. I am now Victor Manuel Zaragoza, and the U.S. Immigration and Customs Enforcement Agency recognizes the growing problem of document fraud. We in Los Angeles, we're known as the document fraud capital um, of the world. Um, it is a problem that is endemic throughout the L.A. County area. Kevin Jeffrey is a special agent with the U.S. Department of Homeland Security. He says the problem is growing throughout the U.S. and Los Angeles is at the center of it all. Not only do we produce the documents, but we supply people who operate mills in different parts of the country. So, I mean, it is a huge criminal enterprise. And people use these fake documents for many reasons. So you can use it for anything. You can open up bank accounts. You can get on, like I said, uh, public transportation. You can enroll in schools. There's a, a, a wide variety of things you can do with these documents. And, and that's why we're so concerned about it. Special Agent Jeffrey says with advanced technology, it's very easy to make fake documents. A Social Security card can be cranked out in two minutes. So with available equipment and an illegal population desperate to stay in the country, this underground economy continues to thrive.